Welcome back to Killing Tanks for Charity! Yay! Alright, for all new people, because we do have some new people on my channel again, this is Killing Tanks for Charity. I host the charity event, and basically how this works is, uh, every tank I kill, five cents a charity pot. Let's just get into battle while I ramble on. Uh, every time you press a like on any one of the Killing Tanks for videos, even if it's last season, I will put five cents to the charity pot. Simple, right? The other thing, this year you guys also picked uh, the charity event where it's going to go into. This year it's going to a fantastic one called Wounded Warriors, and I'm actually doing the Canadian version, uh, woundedwarriors.ca. Uh, I have had a couple private messages of people saying that maybe next year or next season if I continue doing Killing Tanks, uh, which I'm not sure, it might be Killing Warships, I uh, might switch over. Um, in that case, it would uh, I might try to do uh, the Wounded Warriors for the uh, U.S. Uh, just because that's a fantastic uh, it's a fantastic program, no matter which way you look at it. Ganabu Mongol U, <laughs> Ganabu Mongol U. Uh, that sounds like a weird song. Oh, the things you see in chat. It's probably a different language and I butchered the shit out of it. Oh, so, not a lot's been going on. Um, well, yeah, actually, quite a bit. Yeah, I've had a hell of a pile of excitement this week. Um, I haven't made it to work basically one day this week, which is sad. Um, what has been actually going on, which actually freaked the fuck out of me, uh, we had one hell of a fire near here. Um, I could see the smoke and then going, oh, Jesus, right? It's... Well, that was a miss. That was a blatant fucking miss. We didn't penetrate their armor. You idiot. Enemy armor is hit. Jesus, Leopard, could you have done that before? Uh, he knocked my track off, but... I'm not going to repair it. Um, so, anyways, this fire that we had, right? It was a fuck of a doozy. Um, holy shit. Oh, KV-1 must have been damaged. Uh, anyways, this fire, I could, I walked out in the morning to go to, uh, get my big work truck, and, uh, all I could see is smoke, right? And I went, oh, well, somebody's burning a brush pile. Well, that's kind of stupid. It's uh, kind of windy outside, right? Uh, and then I uh, I look and go, oh, shit, you know? It's uh, really getting bad, right? All of a sudden, I see this uh, frickin' flames, and I went, holy shit, big fire, big fire, threw the shovel in the truck and went. I had about four fire crews out there. And I think roughly about, uh, oh, probably close to 200 people were out there. And uh, it was a grain cart. It was a grain cart on fire. Oh, there we go. There's a tank kill for the charity pot. We have a tank kill for the charity pot. That's just how simple it is. That's five cents of the charity pot. Just like that. I might change it up next year, so we have, uh, that one we might, uh, put a little bit more in the charity pot. It's kind of fun and exciting doing it like this. Oh, shit. Okay, we're going to have more guys come out now. Well, I didn't scratch him, but... I can still partially see his bubble here. It's an A43 and it's pissing me off. What? That was bullshit. Oh, more bullshit. But we got one tank kill. So yeah, anyways, the fire was... This fire was one of the most extreme I've seen in a long time. 
There was about 20 foot flames coming out of the back of this grain cart. They managed to unhook, but still. That was uh, pretty gruesome. Okay, I saw. Oh, yeah, it's on fire. Penetration. Penetration. That's uh, an M6. M6 are kind of holy. You can really do some damage to the M6. That's a 30M. Oh, there goes our leopard. I'm the only one. E25. Ha! Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, well, we did something. We got something done for a useless team. More useless teams. Oh, the girl killed the 25 too. That was nice. Um, so yeah, this it was quite a traumatic fire. It burnt up a quarter section, but what's really, really uh, scary is that this thing was only about five miles from my house. And uh, we have this river valley that goes through, and uh, basically the rule of thumb is if you let a fire get to that, it's game over. Uh, there's no way to actually put out the fire if it gets to the valley. Um, and it was only about a mile and a half from the valley, and it was moving at a rate of speed that you've never seen in your entire life. Like, you wouldn't think a fire could move like... 50, 60 kilometers an hour, but it was with the wind, and we had a hell of a time getting it under control, but we did. Uh, there was, of course, being a farming community, we had uh, a significant amount of, uh, of farmers out there that were uh, cultivating the ground up. Uh, we had one of my neighbor that was uh, had his big uh, self-propelled sprayer. It's got a 120 foot boom on it and he was spraying water over the whole field which really helped and uh, then of course af after the all of it I went back and was just seeing maybe control it and go back out and if there was any uh, stubble or anything that was smoking uh, to uh, try to put it out right well shit you know we uh, I went out there and uh, one guy I know owns a gravel pit, and he uh, he came down, and uh, he was actually coming back from a job, and uh, that was sad of you. Um, so he had this D6 cat on the back, right? And he comes up to me and goes, hey, big ears. Well, actually my name, but big ears. Um, do you... Uh, know how to run this. And he says you can get that green car off the field if, uh, cause I gotta go grab a load of gravel here and my gravel truck and bring it back too. And I can pick this up later. And he said, oh yeah, sure. And he says, uh, do you know how to run it? And I look at him and go, no sort of kind of maybe. <laughs> I know the basics on how to use it. I don't really know how to drive it. <laughs> it's kind of like, hmm, well, you know, I'll figure it out. This guy's toast if he actually gets a shot at him. Oh, well, he did get a shot at him. Uh, so, anyways, I, the first few uh, feet were just me sort of staggering across the field with a stupid cat because I was having issues trying to figure out how to drive it. <laughs> it was alright once I started doing it. I tell you, I, I couldn't go to work yesterday, which is Friday, uh, just because my shoulder blades were so freaking sore. I'm not used to trudging it back and forth through a stubbly field. Even if it was partially burnt. It, that is fucking hard on you. And shoot the building. Shoot the building. He can fire faster than you. 
I know that E25 can. But our E25, get back up there. Can fire just as quick as the other E25. However, I would have moved. Well, he did get him. We fucking won? What the hell? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not what I was expecting, but hmm, nevertheless, well done. <laughs> oh, let's play with my new little tank. It's a tier three, but yeah, I've never run it really. I upgraded it, never run it. So yeah, the fire was fun. Oh, my rib cage is sore. My groin is sore. Well, that's because you masturbate too much. No, it's because you're not used to walking on the shit like that. My groin, not my nuts. <laughs> There's quite a bit difference between groin and your actual sack, dudes. <laughs> if you play hockey, you know exactly what I mean. And yes, I am Canadian. Hockey! Do I really watch it? No. <laughs> Watch the playoffs, that's about it. And I watched juniors. That is some good hockey there. Alright, I think I'll go over here. Oh, fuck me. Sleepy. And, and go fuck yourself. Why? You're in a tier 2 and a tier 3. Why, because you're a D2 against a Type 91? I have no idea how this thing performs, so fuck. So fuck it. <laughs> so fuck it! Throw it away! It's a piece of shit. Yeah, I'm the only heavy. What the fuck is going on with Plenix? Plonix. Plonix? Plonix. Maybe it's some sort of sexy dance. <laughs> you're some sort of sexy dance, aren't you? Either that or you hit so much lag that you just stop there. Oh, I'm done. <laughs> We're fucked. That's an H35 that I hear firing. That's a nice little tank. Nice little tank you got there. What the fuck? No. And what do we got here? I don't really have anybody coming out yet. Not that I could uh, see anything. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Bloop, 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 bloop. Cool. Okay. That's sexy. Oh, there we go. There's a tank kill for the old charity pot. Wow. This thing hits hard. I'm impressed. Enemy is hit. Is there we go. Two tank kills. The suspense is killing you. My aim is not too good, apparently, in this. Maybe I need to aim higher. Nope. Apparently, it's right on. Side of your turret's weak. Nope. Oh, I'm getting hit. I'm getting flacked! Flack and Z. I love those little pea shooter guns. Cute. Whoa, hey. What about hoy? Oh, what a hoy. A he de hoy? Random noises! Hmm! Sexy noises! Yes! I don't know. 
when you get older, things just seem right. Hi. What? I fucking missed? I fucking missed. Didn't miss that time. Yes, that's three tank kills! Four tank kills! <laughs> I like this tank! <laughs> oh, fuck. Why couldn't they make more of you? <laughs> oh, wow, that's sexy. We got four tank kills. Five tank kills total this episode. But four fucking tank kills this this match. Oh, he did. Oh boy, you know he did. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, I can't sound black if my life depended on it. <laughs> Can you tell I'm a country or what, boy? <laughs> uh, yeah, that is stereotypical, and I am a stereotypical white boy. There is no difference. Bring it on, boys! Alright, well, tell us where you are. I'm going at the half a speed of smell. Smell you later. Is he over on our end? That little pea shooter should have spotted him. Or he's up in the corner right over there. There, if you saw my minimap. And I don't see him. If you guys got off the flag, we could have fun, but... Nope! I have no idea what this little pea shooter is. Hey though, that was frickin' fantastic gameplay footage for you. For you guys. Oh, uh, well, top damage. What the fuck tank is that? Hang on. Days of rental. Days of rental? Are we renting this thing? Do I really want shit like that? It's a tier four. B2 Panzer. Eh? No, when, when did I get this? Uh, crew? Uh, retain crew? No crew. Return crew? Send crew to barracks. Um, he's a light tank. Leopard. Oh, I could have just done this for fuck's sakes. So you recruiting these guys. This is way better than fucking up my crew. That would have to retrain anyways. Okay, send barracks. Send barracks. Not enough bunks in barracks. Seriously? Seriously? The Shafi I can dismiss. The zero, I don't get any signal boosting. T57. Yeah, 100. Six. I get 100 for him, apparently. 100 for him. 98 for him. This is just experience that you get back, eh? Uh, okay, now if I go like this, now I can send you guys to barracks. Not enough bunks in barracks. I just got rid of a fucking pile of them. Available bunks, 0 out of 33. I have an LTDB. Gunner? Eh? I've never had an LTTP. <coughs> or Foch. I know I've had an IS-7. There's a lot of fucking things in here. I don't know really if this is helping. I still have no bunks. It's like, what the fuck? Mm. 
Mm-hmm. No idea. All right. Well, let's just roll with it. We're going to roll with it. We're going to do a special event thing today. We're going to really, really do this. Mm-hmm. Or maybe not. I don't know. Oh, no, it went. <laughs> so let's see how much more we can do. Uh, already, as you know, that we've got five tank kills this episode. This is pretty spectacular. This 20 cents to the charity pot, if my math serves me correct. No, 25 cents to the charity pot. Fuck, math does not serve me correct. Where did you learn how to do math? I went to school. <laughs> <laughs> it's a rental. Other than that, no idea. <laughs> That's true. All of a sudden, it was we just looked and went, eh? What the hell is this in my inventory? <laughs> no, no, it isn't. <laughs> Should be a pretty good spot, maybe. Oh well, it does damage. Yes, yeah, park there. Why don't you? There's a B2 uh, coming up over the hill. That asshole's still sitting there after all the damage I did to him. And he's just, just behind the building. Damn asshole, he ain't moving. Cover fire! Cover fire! Cover me! I'm going across! Not really going in. I'm going across! This is a weird tank. Fat ass. Weird fucking tank. Um, anybody else notice that they're creeping up over across the line there? I'm trying to see them, but they ain't working. The fuck? Thanks for hitting me. Um, I don't know about you, but guys, but I'm uh, trying to kill the B2 that's coming. Wow, is there armor on these things? Wow, is this thing terrible at killing those? But that gets me thinking. <laughs> this gets me thinking, man. Damage blocking the armor. Because these things are apparently very, very good at blocking damage. Yes, damage blocked. E -e 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 -e, trying to sneak across. Use this as cover. We didn't even scratch them. We didn't penetrate their armor. We didn't even scratch Can them. Can I get underneath them? Nope. That oh, doesn't do anything. Ricochet. That's just ricochets. We didn't even scratch them. 
Okay, the gun is not that great <coughs> at the best of times. Or at the worst of times. Or at any time, really. Or that one went right through. <laughs> okay, well, the gun is not that great on this thing, actually. But we seem to be winning. <laughs> I did some damage! I did a thing! I did a thing! Which is great, but... <laughs> that's so great. Let me guess, there's another B2. No, <clears throat> ninety five. Enemy armor is damaged. Ready to fire. Oh, fuck man, this is gun terrible. <laughs> yeah, this gun is fucking terrible. It's deplorable! I'm just shooting shit at this point. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. He might be over here. Oh yeah, that was pretty close. Pretty close guesstimate. Yep, there we go. Ah, oh, we actually got another tank kill! <laughs> yes! Victory is mine! In a pretty much useless tank! It's a Valentine. Oh, fuck me, this thing's garbage. This thing is a garbage tank. Whoa, that makes you sick. Figures, what are you doing? Quit scoping and driving at the same time. <laughs> yep, going to puke! <laughs> you know he's gonna come in, guys, and he's gonna fuck you over, right? I did actually kill that. I, I didn't kill him. I hit him. I hit him. I did a thing. I did a thing. <laughs> Holy shit, is this tank bad? I did really good though. Sadly. Uh, uh, weird. I guess gold ammo is in order for that one. Um, so anyways guys, that'll be it for this episode. We got six tank kills total. One with the Panther, uh, four with the, uh, with the Type 91 Heavy, which is, uh, this guy back here, which is a fairly decent little tank. And then we got one with the stupid, uh, Panzerkoffen B2 740. 740 sounds like a radio station. Um, so... That'll be it. Uh, so, of course, 5 times 6 is 30 cents to the charity pot. Make sure that you leave the likes because it really does help the charity uh, and whatnot. So, anyways, that's it. Take care. We'll catch you next time.